What's up y'all, it's your girl Melissa here and welcome back to my studio. So, I recently got commissioned to create some artwork for the new Harriet movie that is coming out. I think it's coming out November 1st. So this movie Harriet is about Harriet Tubman. If you don't know who Harriet Tubman is, like I... Just unsubscribe. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, but come on. <laughs> I don't know who Harriet Tubman is. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, the movie is basically about Harriet Tubman, obviously, and basically they reached out to me and I think a few other artists to create artwork inspired by Harriet. And the theme of the artwork is bravery and courage because obviously <laughs> Harriet Tubman. So yeah, I just want to take y'all along on this process of me creating this painting inspired by Harriet and it's gonna be dope. So first thing I'm gonna do is go to Michael's and get me a canvas to work on. But before I do that, I have to go to the post office and mail some orders that I got. These are some packages. Ah, that M Falconer. So yeah guys, first let's go to the post office, then let's go to Michael's, then let's make this painting. Let's go. canvas to be uh, Harriet's face basically like I just want Harriet's face to fill the whole canvas kind of like that and I feel like that would work better on a square canvas than the typical like portrait or landscape you know so they really only have these three sizes of squares so I'm trying to decide which size I want to get I think the 10 by 10 is too small yeah, it's a bit too small, so I probably won't get 10 by 10. And I think the 20 by 20 is good, but the thing is, I want to get this painting done in like a day or two. And the bigger the canvas, the longer it takes. So if I go with the 20 by 20, I'm not sure if I could do that fast versus like the 12 by 12. I know I could knock that out pretty fast. But like it's still not too small, but it's a decent size. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the 12 by 12. And plus I wanted to do like smaller canvases anyways, so this is a good opportunity to do like smaller pieces. Cause I feel like if I do more smaller pieces, I could do more pieces in general. So this is what we're getting today.
well. So my Harriet painting is completely finished. I had a great time painting it. And it was kind of my first time doing a painting like this, like kind of with the subject's whole face in the canvas. Usually I do like portraits of people's like whole heads. Ooh, the doorbell. <laughs> okay, where was I? <clears throat> Usually when I do portraits, it's of the person's whole head with like a background and stuff, but I wanted to try something new because I wanted to fit the words in in a cool way. And I think this combo looks pretty dope and I'll probably do more paintings in this style in the future. So yeah, let me know in the comments what y'all thought of my Harriet Brave painting. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, there's a like button down there that, you know, you can just hit that real quick. <laughs> and, you know, definitely subscribe to my channel if you're into these behind the scenes, painting, art, vlog, art life videos. Yeah. I also officially submitted the piece to Harriet and they loved it. They approved it. I actually already posted it on my page. So if y'all are following me on Instagram, you can see a better picture of all the details of this painting on my Instagram. So definitely follow me on Instagram if y'all aren't following me. There's so much on there. So yeah, thanks again for watching you guys and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.